Obviously this season has been super special. During the winter I trained like normal and then in March we figured out okay there is corona all over the world and everything is changing. So actually during the spring I tried to take it more easy and just ride my bike, do it for fun, just yeah having a good time and then we knew the World Cup would start again in the, um, the fall around September so when the summer arrived I really started to train hard and focus on being the best Molina. Yeah we started the season actually pretty early with racing the Mediterranean Epic. We had some good weeks in Spain racing with the team but then uh, this uh, strange situation came up with uh, Covid and uh, it, it changed a lot. Just at the beginning of uh, lockdown, uh, we stopped to ride. Uh, we decided to stop to ride with my trainer because uh, it was maybe for nothing. It was a it was a good moment to try new things on the training and on the preparation. First goal then was to keep having goals and uh, keep giving goals to the to the riders. Um, the riders, they are like everyone in life, they have goals, but maybe they must have more structured goals because they are really good at that, chasing goals. We started with a plan, like as soon as we heard that some races uh, were cancelled and it, it was going to take a long time to be before racing again, we made a plan. So I just had, a, I think, two easy weeks in the beginning just to like reset the body. And after I, uh, I started training, so the motivation was high all the time. At the moment, I'm super grateful that we can race in, in Nove Mesto and uh, happy to race, happy to have a World Cup, happy to have World Championship, happy to be together with the team and happy to do my job and uh, race my bikes. I had to start from the second row, which was uh, not too bad. Uh, I think all the start loop I was in the front, I could manage my position pretty well and gave me some some space to recover on the on the asphalt on the start finish line. But the last lap I was just I was too tired. Maybe I tried a little bit too much in the beginning and uh, was making some mistakes and really struggling. I I, I need to be happy with this because. <laughs> If you see the steps, I, the progress I make, I made from since last year and even the years before, I think it's a massive progress. So no, I only can be happy. You know. Being with the team for me, it feels like a like a second family. So it's it's always nice. The atmosphere is always good, and this. This also helps a lot to perform on a really high level. And uh, now to be here, it's uh, really nice. Uh, without crowd, it's uh, strange, but uh, yeah, we are happy to, to ride this. So cool to see everyone. So even though my racing might have been a bit up and down, it feels good, you know, I'm, I'm just super happy to be here. <laughs> finding the good lines. A big part of the game in Nova Mesto is finding good lines. And actually that's crazy because it's drier but the roots are more yeah, slippery, slippery than uh, yesterday, than at the beginning of the week when it was wet.
said I was not uh, running enough on the course uh, Thursday. They didn't see me enough, so they want to see me from far away. Yesterday we checked the last lines of the, the new track in Ogamesto. Uh, everything went well, everybody is ready and today is race day, so full gas. It's been a great week here in Novemesto. We are so stoked to be back to the World Cup. Uh, great week for us as well with um, a podium on each men's race. It's been crazy. I think we did really well as teams. Cross country races, we were the team of the day. So, uh, yeah, it was really, really good. And now we are heading to the World Championships next week in Leogang, Austria, and after that to the Europeans. So, looking forward to the next races, and we hope to do uh, at least as uh, good as this week.